Hello, the last part of the finger pattern one and two against each other. Um, now we introduce the fourth finger. We've done all the notes up to three so far. We've done two different bowing patterns. Now we're going to do four fingers and make sure that one, two, and three are nice and round so your little finger can reach without having to make any unnecessary movements because of too much tension yeah the more you tense here the more difficult it is going to be to relax your shoulder and the more difficult it becomes to stretch forward with the right arm so everything influences each other so take it easy and take a step back if you find that something really isn't working if it's too hard work probably didn't do enough repetitions of one of the previous exercises. Yeah, so take a breath, take a step back, repeat a few things and come back to this. So, very slow, everything separated, we're at 40 beats a minute and uh, here we go. One, two, three, four. Three. A, turn away. and C and D C
E, F, G, and A. One, two, three, four. Natural semitone E F. semitone D and E. One, two, three, four. Semitone.
pushing E F sharp G A B one two three four F sharp and G natural. And that's it, the whole second finger pattern, yeah, with one and two against each other. So work your way through this, it's long, but because it's long it'll show a lot of your tensions. If it starts hurting, you know something's wrong. Figure it out, work on it, and come back to this. Okay, next, the usual 60. See you there, bye.